Take a break. All right, everybody. Tom, back at the go. range. Uh, I got the old 450 out. She started in the 50. I mean, she started in that. Uh, I'm going to get her a 50. Mind if I look at it? They're over here shooting. 50 cal. That's a lot of boom right there. I thought it was going to have some boom, but no, this one is. I shot this one here before. It was very nice. But it was years ago. So, yeah. The bear 50 cal is a big old muzzle break. Okay. It's always in my hand. Alright, so we're going to move on over here to, the, uh, to my 450. I already put my uh, heavy buffer in. There's a target down there at 50 yards. Hard to tell. Uh, I got 50. So I'm going to go ahead and send a couple down right I'll get right back to you. Well, she is uh, cycling just good, bolt going back, sending a round back in the chamber, but let's send another one. I am having to shoot off this because I fucking can't rest at home. The width of it at 50 yards is shooting. It's about an inch and a half, maybe two inches high, which is good because I can see these browns going, hitting that paper. They leave pretty big ass. Alright, I'm gonna take a few more shots. Just, just, uh, just uh, 50 yards. Uh, before I get started, I'm gonna say the actually the bear creek upper. Bear creek arsenal upper that I got from them. Um, I purchased this for my own money. Alright, so you're clear uh, to send it around down the range. I'm just doing a review. Oh, no. Like when I first. The buffer was too light, so I went to a heavy one, which is perfect now. It's running well, we're not eating smooth tonight. like a champ. <laughs> so far, this upper is doing very I'm not a vegetarian. I don't heavy I'm barrel, it's, it's not a I'm actually... I'm just not so I guess that's one of the pros. Heavy barrel. Sorry. Uh, one of the pros of having a heavy barrel. It does not get hot. So, like I said, I am shooting 50 yards. It is about two inches high. Not bad. This Vortex uh, Spark C AR Red Dot is actually holding well to this recoil. Uh, I did tighten it down uh, just to make sure that it's not going anywhere. So, like I said, Bear Creek Upper, Bear Creek Arsenal Upper on this one with the uh, Palmetto State Lower. So let's send some more downrange. It does hurt. I'm not gonna. So I'm gonna put it on safe so that you can just play Compared around. Compared to the with it, my weight, it, it has way safe. more recoil. But I mean, it's it's not that bad. Because it's a heavy buffer, supposed to reduce some of that. And I will be getting a can for this one later. Uh, the next couple weeks, I'm gonna go order it, which is from. Uh, a place called Capital Armory in uh, Park, Texas that I went to go see the other day. Uh, I saw one on the 
So we were back uh, about a couple weeks ago to work on that. Hey, but I'm sorry if the rounds are hitting you. I'm sorry if the rounds hit you. We're just gonna check it out here in a minute. So she's good to go with the same You just heard go on. Way over there. Boom. Over here. <laughs> what other guys actually got scared? I wasn't paying attention. I don't know what the hell he's doing. I'm going to stop. Thank you. Make sure you can see those targets. Fire. Yeah. Make sure you can see those targets. Hi, everybody. They got it. Uh, that was part two of the video that I just did, which is for the, uh, the 450 Bushmaster AR. Uh, everything was great. Cycle well, injected every single round. A little bit less recoil with the heavy backer. So uh, we're gonna go take a look here at the target here in a minute. And we're gonna see how she did at uh, 50 yards. So let's go, let's go check it out. All right, everybody. So this is a 450 at 50 yards. All right there. I was aiming here. They're all right here. Don't mind these two. These are my three weight I just shot just to see how the is gonna group real quick at 50 yards, which is perfect. I, all I did was just dial it over like two clicks. And I'm gonna leave it like that. So, like I said, that's the 450. It's not bad at uh, 50 yards. Pretty good grouping. I mean, like I started. This is my first three. This is my next, and I shot more over here, over here. You know, it's not bad. So yeah. Once again, I'm Tom with Texas 5 and 12 Outdoors. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more videos. And part three coming up with the 590 Mossberg shotgun. Let's get it. <laughs> 